Hello, I'm Rob. And I'm Missy, and we're volunteers with Mission Possible at Church Under the Bridge. Well, we had heard of, we've heard of Church Under the Bridge for a few years, so we knew about Church Under the Bridge. But about a year and a half ago, we were just sitting at church and felt like there was something different that God wanted us to be doing. And so uh, we decided to go down to Church Under the Bridge and we just showed up and we didn't have any um, idea of what we would do or what that would look like. We just showed up and we've been showing up most Sundays since. One of the things that we feel like we're doing when we're following Jesus down there is loving on people uh, the way He loves us. We've definitely been transformed, both of us. I would say, you know, every time you go, you're, what's it gonna be like? It's different every time. It's literally the most fun we've ever had in church. You never know what's gonna happen, but we always know Jesus is there. I mean, we have no doubt every time we go, we're just gonna watch Him move. And we just show up and we feel like we just get to partner with Him. You may be scared when you go, and that's okay. You can just go scared. And you may be uncomfortable, and that's okay. I heard a pastor say one time that we wouldn't need the comforter, the Holy Spirit, if we weren't ever going to be uncomfortable. And so we just depend on Him and count on Him to show up every time, and He does. Serving can be many different forms. It can yeah. be serving coffee, it can be serving lunch, it can be sitting down and praying with people. Mm -hmm. So we don't feel worthy of a lot of these things, but God is using us yeah. in a way that is just a true blessing for us. One of my favorite scriptures is Isaiah 58, and uh, God talks about spending yourself on behalf of the poor, and feeding the hungry and clothing them, and, um, and then he says towards the end of that chapter that you will be called a restorer of streets with dwellings, and I think what we want is for everybody to know the love of God. We don't think there's one person that he's not saying, I love you, it's my kindness that leads you to repentance. And so we're just thrilled we get to be a part of that. Every day we leave, we go, I can't believe we get to do this. And when you're down there, you think, I get to be a part of the kingdom coming on earth and restoring the streets of Austin, actually.